New information, we are getting our first look at new court documents unveiling a timeline and possible motive for the incident that prompted an hour long lockdown at UNC Chapel Hill yesterday. The court documents released just prior to the suspect's court hearing this afternoon alleged 27 year old Mikkel Harris went to the Alpine Bagel Shop at UNC Student Union yesterday just before one to confront a store supervisor about his friend's recent firing. The supervisor told investigators Harris pointed a gun at him and threatened to shoot him in the head. The documents also reveal investigators searched Harris's apartment where he lives with his grandmother. They reported finding a handgun, receipts of purchasing the handgun, and 13 rounds of ammo along with a gun lock and firearm box. Harris is due in Orange County Court today at 2. Meanwhile, at UNC Chapel Hill, classes are back in session as students and faculty try to process what happened and what is supposed to be a safe space for learning. Soon after the incident yesterday, the chancellor acknowledged the fear and frustration reverberating through campus. Thankfully, no one was injured. But imagine the stress, the trauma, and the anxiety that a second lockdown in 16 days has caused for our students, our faculty, and our staff. Counseling and psychological services are available for anyone who needs someone to talk with. Law enforcement says it is currently reviewing procedures and looking at ways to improve safety.